G'day Gemini, gonna do your love energy update for July. Is that today? Let's see what's love energy is coming towards you. Is that now? So, this could be someone from the past, someone in the present. Oh, excuse me, someone from your future. Cross watches. This could be you, this could be someone else. Alright. <laughs> Let's get to it. Three cards for the love energy coming towards Gemini, please. Got him. Alright, we have separation. Time apart from your partner is on the horizon. Someone who's in separation from you. Ooh, pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you. Ooh, they may see some red flags. <laughs> mm, interesting. And honeymoon. Enjoy the bliss of holiday time together. Mm, but they may want to take you away somewhere. Bottom of the deck. Ooh, new love. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. Mm, could be someone new. Alright. Let's find out. Okay. Why is the love energy coming towards Gemini? Why are they in separation from Gemini? Ooh. Let me get that card out. Okay. Lovers and the Six of Pentacles. Got a bit bent. Let's see. Yeah, you could have been lovers in the past, but it wasn't balanced. It wasn't a balance give and take. Well, as you're in separation, they want to make the choice to balance things out. Let's see what's on the bottom here. Ooh, ten of cups. Oh. An eight of wands. I want a message. Hmm. Ten of cups. No, they were pretty happy. I thought you were their happy ever after. Thought it was divinely guided, but it wasn't balanced. So there was some sort of separation. They want to talk about that now. Hmm. Well, they want to balance things out now and get that back. Right, tell me about pay attention to the red flags. What are the red flags they're seeing? Why are they seeing red flags? Oh, flying. Seven of Pentacles and Knight of Swords. Hmm. Reviewing the past, they've seen they need to cut something out. Things need to be cut out. What they've invested in, what you've invested in. Coming in with some truth and clarity, the red flags. Investing in the wrong things. Were they investing in the wrong things? They're seeing red flags and cutting those things out now. Mm, bottom of the deck is the eight, uh, sorry, nine of cups. Wish fulfillment, but it's also um, emotional set like, bleh. can't speak properly. Is that what's going on with them? They can't speak properly. All right. This is emotional fulfillment um, within yourself. Two nine of cups make a ten of cups. I know it doesn't add up to ten. <laughs> but two people who are emotionally fulfilled come together. to make, And that's how you get a real ten of cups. Um, but yeah, they might have been a bit, this can also be self-satisfaction, selfishness, could have been drinking. Mm, they're looking at that, reviewing that past, the red flags that they caused in the past, and they're cutting them out for this new beginning, because they know there was disappointment. Things weren't stable. All right, tell me about honeymoon. There's honeymoon here. What's 
six honeymoon they want with Gemini. Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. You know, I'm going to say it. Oh, we've got one card. We need more than one. Thank you. Okay, we've got the Hermit. We've got the Three of Pentacles. And we've got all the Nine of Swords. So they've gone within to do some soul searching. And they want to work on things. They've been up all night stressing about this. They want to spend some time with you. Holiday time together. I'm going to spend some time with you. They're stressing about it. Whether you're want, going to want to work with them. But they have done some inner work. They've gone within to think about this a lot. About how they're going to get you to spend some time with them. Get you to work with them on this. Hmm. Very stressed out about it, yeah, because they've got the five of cups at the bottom of the deck because they know they've disappointed you in the past. There's been disappointment in the past. They understand that why you separated from them, because it wasn't stable. Not this stable new beginning, but this toxicness. And self-sufficient and single. Did they act like they were single? A bit with that red flags, a bit guarded and caused betrayal and secrets. But they've, that's turned. They've seen the light on that and it's stressed them out. Want things more balanced and to reconcile and have this new beginning with you and heal things. Mm, they want this stable new love with you. Interesting. Alright. Let's see what else. What else can you tell us about this love energy coming towards a Gemini? Three cards, please. Okay, we have helpful people. We have yes. And we have a year from now. Mm. Could be in a year's time, could be within a year. Oh, and bottom of the deck is a definite yes. Mmm, definite yes. Definite yes on that new love and stability. Mmm. Okay. So, love energy coming towards Gemini. What are these helpful people been helping them with? Helping them with that Nine of Swords and the King of Cups. <sighs> helping them with these sleepless nights that they've been stressing about. Helping them to control their emotions. Pour out their emotions. Show their emotions. Release their emotions. Yeah, they've been stressed out. People have been helping them with this. Their emotional blockage. Yeah, because six of pentacles. It was they weren't balanced. They weren't balanced with their emotions in the past. So someone they've been helping them. Yeah. They need to apologise for that past so they can heal. Because they were guarded. 
and possibly played mind games and <laughs> cheated buying, stealing. Mm, they want to become more balanced and close out that cycle. They're more in control now from what they've learned. But they're undecided whether you're going to hold back. Still keeping secrets and there's things I don't know. But they want to offer something stable. But there's a devil here regarding what they've invested in him before. And that selfishness. <coughs> want some truth on that. Passionate messages of love and new love but have they transformed? Are they? Do they really want this Ten of Pentacles with you? Stability. You want to know the truth about this love. Mm. Yeah, there was more, I know. But, yeah. What's this yes? Why do they think yes? Why do they think yes? but I want more. Tell me that yes. Well, no. That's a massive amount. I'm not taking all of that. I'll try again. What's this? Yes. Ooh, the truth. Okay, fair enough. Let's take that. Yes, so yes, truth. Like, yes, they want to come in with truth and clarity. And have controlled their passions, to control their actions now with the King of Wands. I want to charge forward triumphantly and have this reconcile things with you, have a new beginning after walking away, after you walked away possibly with the separation. Let the wheel turn, they've got a different perspective, they understand why you rejected their offer and because they couldn't make it the choice to offer something stable. Hmm. Okay. Tell me about a year from now. What's this a year from now? Ooh. Five of Pentacles. A year from now, they could be out in the cold. Yeah, because of the, if they keep being toxic and having third parties and causing fights because it's a burden on any stable relationship. Logically, they know that it was a betrayal to be juggling and guarded and holding back, keeping secrets. I think a year from now, it's just going to be the same thing. A year from now, out in the cold because of their toxicity. Or someone's toxicity. Hmm. We've got yes and three of cups at the bottom of the decks. New love stability, but yes... Reconcile or third party? I don't know about this one, Gemini. Don't know about this one. A year from now, they could have left out in the cold all this toxicity, but I don't know. A year from now, they'll be left out in the cold because they're still being toxic. Oh, I haven't asked the question yet. Alright, what else can you tell us about this love energy coming towards a Gemini? Mask, not showing true feelings, hide, personify, pretend, delude, gaslighting. <sighs> Don't like that. Tell me more. Tell me more. I 
Butterfly, relationship evolving to the next phase, healing the inner child growth. So are they not hiding things anymore? Have they transformed? Have they changed? What's at the bottom? Healthy choices. Making healthy choices in love and in life. Self-love, self-care, being happier. Okay, and they're making healthy choices now. Take a chance, risk, love, twin flames, heart with a key self-indulgence but that's self-work shadow work focusing on self maybe they have maybe they do make healthy choices now maybe yes they do want to reconcile that year from now with the five of pentacles what's that saying alright Let's see. Are they going to leave that devil stuff out in the cold? But it's going to take them a year. Hmm. Actually, before we do that, I'm going to get out a different deck. My little mini deck. Good old faithful. It's looking all grubby and tattered. <laughs> I don't care. Alright, you'll tell me. What's this five of pentacles and the devil in a year from now? We need to know. Are they leaving that toxicness out in the cold? Alright, we have the king of pentacles and the six of pentacles again. Three times you've got this six of pentacles. Okay, more stable and balancing things out. What's at the bottom here? Is that Nine of Swords again? That's three times that's come out too, so I'm going to leave that out. The sun's under that. So, hmm, I guess they are going to leave that out in the cold. Because they want to become more stable. And balance things out because it's just been stressing them out to the max. Mm, a year from now though. A year from now. It's going to take them a year. Maybe what they did. Then it's going to take them a while before you'll forgive them for what they did. They need to, the toxicity could be, that stress for whatever guilt they have. They're just not giving that balance, give and take. It's eating them up. Hmm. Right, what would this love energy coming towards Gemini? What would they like to say to Gemini? Four cards, please. That's two, three, four. We have, I can't right now. I don't know if you want them right now. <laughs> We've got a bit of healing to do. They need to get over this thing they're stressing about. I love holding you. Okay. That's nice. You make my skin tingle. Mm. Uh, the devil could be passion. But. Mm, I'm not really seeing that. And. I've hidden my love for you. Well you didn't make things balanced. That's for sure. You need to balance things out. Finally, I think they might, but they're still stressing about it. They're stressed about how things weren't balanced. Were you not balanced with them? 
They knew you were the one, but it wasn't balanced. The red flags. I'm looking at those things, but mm, they're stressing out about the disappointment of spending time, if they don't get to spend time with you and they're left alone. It's, they've got friends helping them or someone's help, helpful people. could be therapy even. Some sort of therapy of some sort. Seeking professional help. But they're stressing out about things not being balanced. not Or them not being balanced even. But yes, they want to tell you the truth and take some sort of action. Tell you about the, the truth about the action that they're taking. A year from now, it might take them a year worth of therapy. Before they can be more stable because they weren't balanced. And it's stressed them out. It's become something really toxic. Bottom of the deck, I'm afraid it will never work out. Oh my god. Yeah, that, well, that's the bottom line, isn't it? Three Nine of Swords, three Six of Pentacles. They're freaking out because they need to balance things out with you. They want things to be balanced with you. Wow. Mm. Definitely can't sleep at night. Up all night. Stressing about you. They know they've given off red flags, or you've given off red flags, one of the two. Is it red flags because you invested in yourself? I mean, there's nothing wrong with investing in yourself as long as you're not selfish. Like, but yeah, there's, they're not showing their feelings. They want that ten of cups. Mm. Yeah, I think maybe they're a bit over emotional or just some sort of disappointment here. Wow. Wow. Yeah, I think they're going to leave that toxic devil energy, whatever it is, that's stressing them out with this Six of Pentacles, Nine of Swords. They're going to become more stable. They're going to leave that out in the cold. But it might take them a year. Or well, within a year. Could be tomorrow. Could be next month. Could take a year. As it says in those books, a year from now doesn't mean you have to wait a year. It could happen anywhere from now up to a year. So, hmm. Wow. Well. Hmm. Alright, well, I hope you got something out of it. Um, don't forget to give a like and subscribe and share. All that good stuff. And, um, yeah, we'll do another reading next week and see how they're going. Wow. This person is so stressed. About things not being balanced. Or about giving to others. Could be giving to others. Six of Pentacles can be giving to others. Hmm. All right. Well, good luck. And, um, yeah. All the best. I'll catch you later.